What's up guys, Felix the Creator here. In this short tutorial I will show you a stylish zoom through effect created in Adobe Premiere Pro only. So let's dive into the timeline. Okay, let's create a stylish smooth zoom through effect here in the timeline. But first of all a big shout out to the YouTube channel from Chestnut. His tutorial was a big inspiration for this one here. Okay, in the first step bring the first clip to video track 2, so drag it above. Zoom a bit in by dragging here this line. Go to the end of this clip and export a frame by clicking here on this photo icon. So make sure to set a marker right here so you will import this into your project as well and hit OK. And as you can see you will find the screenshot right here in the project window. Drag and drop the screenshot exactly into the timeline where you have exported your frame. Go 12 frames to the right by clicking the right arrow on your keyboard. Hit the C on your keyboard to select the razor tool or select the razor tool here in the toolbar. And make a cut at 12 frames. Hit the V on your keyboard to jump back to the selection tool or click here on the selection tool in the toolbar. Select the rest of the clip and delete it. Bring the second clip here underneath the freeze frame. So bring it one frame to the left. And what we want to do is to create a zoom effect. So select the screenshot, go to the effect controls here on the left side. In this case, we want to use a ellipse mask because we have a round object. So click right here on this one and now customize your mask or if you use a free mask, make sure to trace out your path. Go back to the effect controls and click on inverted to invert the mask. At this point make sure that the cursor stands at the beginning of your freeze frame. Go to the motion controls and set a keyframe here at the position and a keyframe at scale. Now bring the cursor here to the end. and change the scale size and the position. If you change the scale size and the position, you will see that Premiere Pro automatically created the second keyframe. And as you can see, we have created this zoom through effect really fast. But we want to make the whole transition much smoother. So go to the effects here on the left side and search for the film dissolve. You will find the film dissolve transition under the video transition tabs in the dissolve folder. Drag and drop this one here on this clip here underneath. Make sure to change the duration by dragging the transition here on the right side. So change the duration to six frames. You can also change the length by double clicking on a transition and change the duration right here. Okay. And now we have a much smoother zoom through transition created here in Adobe Premiere Pro. Nice. If you like these kind of effects, make sure to check out one of my latest favorite videos where I show you how you can create a trippy music video effect only with Adobe Premiere Pro. So check this out and hear you soon, Felix the Creator.